Hey guys, this is Aaron. I want to take a look at the difference between soft, smooth, and hidden edges in SketchUp. So right here on my chessboard, I have a chess piece. You can see that there's uh, no cleanup, no hiding, no smoothing of any kind happening. I have a bunch of lines, bunch of surfaces. Um, this is standard, nothing special. If I select one of these lines, you can see I have an empty info here, soft, smooth, hidden, all turned off. Just a standard piece right here. If I slide down my board, here I have the same piece copied, the whole thing selected and all the lines set to soft. So this is what soft does. Soft basically takes the lines out of it, but you can see as I move around, I can still see each of the faces very well. Kind of a faceted look here. So the, the shading, the shadows that happen on here are the same as what's happening over on the standard piece. If I slide down a little more, I have a piece that is completely smoothed. So smooth, you can see it's kind of the opposite of what soft is. In smooth, I still have all my lines, just like I had in the original one, but as I move it around, you can see I have a nice smooth shadow. See darker here at the edges, where the light's hitting it directly. It's got this nice smooth gradient between shadows uh, and light. So that is a smoothed piece. If I keep moving down, I have soft and smooth. So when the piece is softened and smoothed, you can see that the lines are gone and I get this nice smooth uh, shadows, just like in the previous piece. So that's, that's softened and smoothed. If I keep sliding down here, I have hidden. Now hidden, you see, looks a lot like our piece back here that was just softened. In fact, it's, it's, for all intents and purposes, for this view, it's exactly the same. The difference between hidden and soft is this window right here. So soft and smooth, softened and smooth edges. When a line is set to soften and smooth, I can actually choose at what angle two surfaces hit to hide that line. With hidden, lines are always hidden. With softened and smooth lines, I can actually tell it based on how far I slide the slider if a line should be smoothened or not. Smoothened? Yes, smoothened. If I hop back here to this piece, I got one more piece on the board, I'm going to grab this whole piece and I'm going to use the user interface to soften and smooth geometry. Now here's what I mean about uh, using the slider. If I slide this down, Eventually, I'm going to get all of my lines back, so at zero degrees. So as I move this up, as these shallower surfaces meet, the lines between them disappear. So this gives me the ability to go, okay, that's the amount of lines I want to get rid of. Or if I want to keep going, maybe there's more, maybe I want to smooth out that top. Or maybe I want to go crazy and just smooth everything out. Now you do have to be careful because at some point you can get uh, too smooth if that's possible where your shadows will start to do kind of weird things based on the geometry. Um, generally speaking, somewhere under 90 degrees will give you the best, uh, most realistic look because 90 degrees I maybe want that hard line, but the rest of them I want to smooth out. So this is soft and smooth edges. This lets me actually control with user interface which lines are visible and which lines are hidden. So, that is the difference between standard, soft, smooth, softened, and smooth, and hidden lines. Thank you.